Hi. It's another, it's another one for the Twilight Hour, baby. Um, also, before we get into, like, anything, um, I want to, I want to go over some quick stuff, uh, regarding some visual changes for the stream and also some alert changes that you might already somewhat notice. Um, I'm, I'm trying out a new, like, uh, a uh, set of like nerd or die presets for my um like event ticker at the bottom and for uh like alerts and stuff so y you know y'all will see that as it comes in um one change that i feel like i need to disclose um for the alerts is that i'm going to experiment with removing text to speech um, it's not like a set in stone decision. If it's too much of a bummer for people, then I, I will absolutely like gladly consider bringing it back. Um, but you know, I figured since I'm changing like the alert aesthetic, uh, the whole, the, the new, the new point of it is to, um, maybe be a little bit more like not out of the way, but a little bit more like integrated into the overlay and, and, and. You know, like I said, y'all will kind of see as stream goes on, assuming people, you know, interact with stream in those ways. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I honestly, it, and it's not even because, like, TTS has, like, been an issue for me, per se. Like, it's it's just that it kind of, um, I feel like, I don't know, it's just, it's been a little bit since I tried without TTS. And... You know, there are, there are times where it can maybe be a little bit intrusive or like maybe Oh, hey, look at that. Look at that. So, um here's so here's a cool thing. So, yeah, so there's a new like ticker animation. Uh that's that's all stock. That that's all stock just with the thing that like I bought this pack. Um so, you know, not impressive on my part. Uh it's pretty cute though. And then the alerts I have set to come down from the top of chat window when we're on this overlay. And then uh, when I say, for example, bring up like the Elgato overlay, you'll, you think like, oh shit, that like, that um, that like gets, yeah. Oh, oh see, thank you uh, Robinverse for demonstrating that for me so immediately. Or uh, Senor Bob, thank you for gifting a sub to Robinverse. Um, I'll have to fiddle with the, um, uh, yeah, here's, uh, here's, here's Kasuga. Man, I missed that guy already. Um, <laughs> uh, sorry. Uh, I'll have to, um, I'll have to fiddle with, like, getting the, uh, alerts to properly, like, attribute when a sub is gifted and whatnot. That'll come later. Um, this is more just, like, a test run. Uh, but yeah, so when, when the, uh, when the... In case you missed it, when the display and like console overlays are up, literally it's it's all it's all been perfectly timed. That's crazy. In the upper left, just in case you missed it again, um, I'll play it one more time. I'll do the replay. Boom! There you go. It comes in on the upper left, and it kind of like blends into the uh, the like window theming I have going on there. So. And then when I have it pulled down, it comes in from the top of chat. So I figured that was a nice sort of, uh, I don't know, way to integrate it more smoothly into my overlay. So it's like not just in front of everything on the middle left, which is how it's been for like at least, God, I, I, a long time. <laughs> it's been that way for a long time. I'm not going to try to estimate exactly. Um, now it looks like. Now it looks like a bard named Seth subbed twice. Uh, but you did sub for four months. I appreciate it so much. You're on a two-month streak. That means a lot to me. Thank you, thank you. Uh, thank you. Uh, also, I don't know if I thanked uh, Nat20. Um, and uh, Combo Winner, thank you so much for the sub as well. Lots of, lots of good vibes. Nice two in the morning. Why am I not tired? I don't know. I'm I'm dealing with the same thing. <laughs> Why are you asking me? Oh shit! It uh it's cutting into the here. I'll have to um having two long usernames back to back actually kind of 
cuts into it. Hold on. Oh damn it! I can't fix this without um. Eh, it's, oh, whatever. It'll it'll fix itself eventually. I'll have to tweak that stuff. Uh, but right now it's over the <clears throat> five hundred and five hundred and eighty subscribers does not feel like the right amount of subscribers. Is that just me? It was it was at seven hundred earlier tonight. Is that just is that the di did a bunch of subs run out at the same time? Did like hundreds of subs run out at the same time, or is this just a glitch? Because that's weird. Either way, that's a little weird. Um, not gonna stress about it too much though. If it is the real count, um, then you know I'm I'm not too pressed about it. I will say. It will make uh, an upcoming event stream that I have planned a little more difficult. <laughs> but that's... Yeah, it's neither here nor there. Didn't someone gift, like, 100 subs ages ago? You know what? That might be part of it. I don't know. It, 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 must, it must be something. like If that's an accurate number, it must have been something like that. Because I feel like I, I, well, like, I've been at, I've been circling around seven, eight hundred, like, for weeks now. Maybe. I don't know. Anyway, um, I can talk about, yeah, so I, I'm planning an event stream for mid-October. <clears throat> I'm very excited about it. No, that looks like an accurate count, because, uh, Morgan Space just gifted five subs, which, by the way, thank you so much. Um, damn, I, I guess that, that number was being, uh, elevated by some big gifts. Uh, oh no, is it gonna go down all of the, oh, yeah, it goes down all the individual gifted ones. Um, I'll have to adjust all this stuff. <laughs> oh man. Okay, in actual stream use case scenario, this is a lot messier than I intended it to be, but that's okay, that's why we, that's why this is a... That's why this is a lower stake stream. That's why we test these things. Um, so yeah, let me talk about the event stream that I'm planning. I don't have a whole lot of details just yet, but I do kind of know the general gist. It's gonna be painful. I'm excited about it. Fun. It's not Halloween themed, but uh, you could call it scary. Um... So next month, um, on the 14th, a, a little, a, a brand new game releases. And it's one that is sort of, um, sort of a deathly harbinger of sorts. Um, that, that game is uh, Nick, Nickelodeon Kart Racers 3, Slime Speedway. I believe that's what it's called. Um, 1,000 sub goal, half joking. That's not a joke. <laughs> so here's, so here's what I'm going to do. You may remember, um, you may remember, uh, at some point it was, I, I, I think it was last year. Um, I did a platinum stream marathon, which if you don't know is a, is like a marathon stream that I've done twice now with two different Nickelodeon related games where I try to get the platinum trophy for a video game in one sitting. The first time it was with SpongeBob Battle for Bikini Bottom Rehydrated. Uh second time it was uh it was Nick Nick Kart Racers 2. And Nick Kart Racers 2 was uh infamous. It went down in history as a failure of a platinum run stream. We did not get the platinum because the game became evil. Everything was going great. We were on wonderful pace. We were going to beat it in like 12, 14 hours, it seemed like. It was good, just going to be a nice, healthy marathon. And it was good feelings all around. And the game became evil and introduced um, a difficulty called Insane Difficulty. That was quite literally insane. It was quite literally fucking unhinged and evil and fucked up. And it ruined the stream. Because I could not make any progress. I could not make any progress on the Platinum. As soon as that difficulty dropped, 
It was like, it was done. And then I did eventually platinum the game on my own time. And I kid you not, it took like over a month, I think. If I, if I, if I remember correctly, it took weeks at least. It, it was a nightmare. So I'm doing things a little differently this time. I am still going to do a Nick Kart Racers 3 trophy related event stream. But here's the, here's the twist. Um, and this is probably something you'll hear me talk about both as it gets closer. Anonymous, thank you so much for the five gifted subs. Jesus, thank you. Um, something you might hear me talk about as it gets closer and as I like figure out more of the affairs. And also just on maybe a stream where more people are going to be there to hear it. Um... Uh, Kariya Kreo, thank you so much for the sub as well. Um, that'll come up in just a sec. Um, uh, so, like, you know, you'll, you'll hear about this again, eventually. But, uh, as of right now, here's, here's, here's the deal for the first time. So, I'm combining a Platinum Run stream marathon with a subathon because... I've had this, like, this kind of soft goal. Not real. It's not something I've really pushed for a whole lot. But it's, like, I've had it on the mind, and it's something I would really like. I would really appreciate. And uh, that goal is to reach um, a minimum 1,000 subs by the end of the year. Uh, because, like I said, for a while, I was hovering around, like, seven 800. And I was like, oh, shit, that feels like actually kind of doable and you know if i keep pushing then you know maybe maybe it'll get there and i've wanted to do a subathon for a while because i've never done a subathon and when it comes to twitch income um i've tried to sort of become a little more sub focused um rather than relying on donations and stuff as much as they are still appreciated don't get me wrong um but you know it's it's less consistent um, and subs are by their nature consistent, right? So, you know, that, that, that's something I, I, I did like, a, oh, like over a year ago, that was something I worked to change about my Twitch platform and it's, it's been going well, it's been going really well. And as my streams sort of steadily grow and, and, and people steadily become like regulars, you know, we've, we've inched towards that goal. You know, I, I, um, hold a lot more consistent subs now than I did like, than I did like a year ago. And I'm very thankful for that. And so I've, you know, I had this thought, I'm like, well, shit, could we get to a thousand before the end of the year? Cause I feel like that'd be a really cool milestone. Um, and you know, I've never pushed for a sub milestone before, but you, like I said, I've wanted to do a subathon for a little bit. It was just a matter of like, well, when the fuck would I even do that? What would I even do? Like, do I have like a unique idea for it? Like what the hell? So I had this idea. So, so, my first subathon is going to be uh, a, a a combination of a subathon and a platinum run marathon. So combining an idea I've done before successfully and unsuccessfully with a subathon, something I've never done before. So that's exciting in and of itself. So here's here's the rundown in terms of the the structure I have in mind right now, and this is subject to change, but the general idea is. Um, I would start the stream with like a minimum goal for amount of trophies to, to gather during the stream. And I would have to stream until I got at least that base amount of trophies out of however many trophies there are, right? So then past that, I would have, um, sub goals that steadily, once we hit certain milestones, increase the amount of trophies I have to get until the pinnacle being you have to stream until you get the platinum at a certain threshold. Which, at the moment, could go either way. That could either be... That could either be the 1,000 mark. If we hit it, like, if we hit 1,000 subs, I have to keep streaming until the game is platinumed. It could either be that, or it could be a thing 
where the platinum maybe comes a little lower. And if we hit a thousand subs, it's like the stream keeps going past the platinum. And then I have like, I have like a set, maybe like X, I'm literally brainstorming in the moment. This is not all figured out yet. Maybe it could like exponentially increase in milestone um, count to like, so like, for example, maybe like a hundred subs past a thousand would be like the stream extends for like another three hours, right? And then maybe like 200 past that, it extends for another three hours. And then maybe it just like keeps going until then. Um, that, that's a case where like, I honestly don't think I would be in too much danger of like <laughs> meeting too many of those like stretch goals, right? Like if I had to guess, if things got really crazy and people were like crazy generous, I could see it maybe being like a, you know, 24 hour plus stream, but that's like, that's, I feel like even pushing it. I don't have any expectation for that whatsoever. So it's like, you know, it simultaneously feels like that's a dangerous concept because I would literally be like beholden to like people subscribing to like stay broadcasting. But then also like there's no guarantee. And I mean, who's to say it would even happen in the first place? Maybe we don't even reach the platinum threshold. Um, but either way, that's the general gist. Uh, that's uh that's the idea and something i'm excited about put some kind of upper cap yeah that's that's probably what i would do if i do the stretch goal idea like i would maybe cap it at like 48 hours <laughs> like just a hard hard lock and that's that's still a maybe like i said all of this every single facet of this is subject to change um but right now um i have that kind of a. Uh, I have that idea set for the 15th of October. Game comes out on the 14th. Um, that might change depending on when the trophy list is, rele is, uh, is released. Um, normally, if, it, if I am correct in assuming, because this is normally the case, I believe trophy lists tend to release earlier than games. I think it depends on the game, but I'm pretty sure the trophy list for Nick Kart Racers 2 was leaked before the game released. Um, and, I, and I know a lot of games are similar uh, in, in recent years. So um, it would, it, you know, it'd have to be a thing where like, I would have to make sure I have enough access to, like, I would have to make sure I have access to the amount of trophies there are. Otherwise, like, the idea doesn't work. You know, I have to organize the goals around trophy count. Because if I, if I plan for, like, you know, say, like, 25 trophies or whatever, and there's only 20, <laughs> or there's, like, 50, you know, it's like, that's a problem either way. So, um, if, if the game only reveals its trophies when it comes out on the 14th, uh, the stream might happen past the 15th. So I'll, I'll have more of an idea as we get closer to those dates. Um, Soup Troop, thank you for the sub. And, uh, Artie Glitch, thank you as well. Appreciate that a ton. Uh, so, yeah, that's the idea. That's my, that's my sort of soft, that's my soft announcement of uh, the Nick Car Racers 3 subathon. I'm very excited. Hey, we had 6,000. We had 6,000. Oh my God, could you imagine? We had 600. Thank you. Thank you, y'all. I appreciate it. Could you plan based on percentage? I could. I could, but that's too much math. That's too much math I would have to do on stream, probably. We'll see. I'll figure it out. Um, I got a, I got a few weeks, so... um. I got a little less than a month, but still near a month. So I'm not too worried about it. I'm I'm gonna be working on this idea over over the next couple weeks. Um and it's you know, it's 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 also not gonna be a purely solo thing. Uh like last time I'll be in like a Discord channel with uh like open invitation to plenty of clown house friends. So 
you'll probably see people popping in and out. Uh, so that's, I'm, I'm actually like the, you know, the more I think about it, the more it becomes like a tangible idea. Like I'm really excited about it. Um, I think it's going to be really fun. So that's the idea. If that's my next like event event. Um, but for now, uh, what are we up at 2am for? We're up to fucking play Slime Rancher 2, baby. Hold on. I need to turn on my fan. I'm so excited. Um, it's technically Sunday, which is when I said I would likely stream Slime Rancher 2. So, uh, I'm gonna play Slime Rancher 2. Aubergine's stirring from his bed because Slime Rancher time. Uh, he stirs from his bed at the slightest sound of a sock shuffling on hardwood at times it feels actually i haven't seen him in a little bit i don't know where he is he actually might be sleeping in the bedroom just you know taking up all the space on our big fucking bed like he owns the place it's sunday i thought it was wednesday i legit like um i would not be surprised if it was and like that was something I literally checked after I went live and after I sent out the notification. I just had this little like ping in my head that was just like, oh God, what if it's not actually Sunday? <laughs> what if it's like, fuck, like, what if it's fucking Monday or Friday? And I'm like, <laughs> I was just, I just like, it's like, oh my God, I'd be so embarrassed. No. What rent does he pay? You're going to freak out. He's such a freeloader. I am not fucking kidding. I turned on this game. I turned on this game and I smelled berries. It was just like a small, like, it, I don't even, it's gone now. But it was just like a, I had like a whiff of like, of like berries. What the fuck? 4D experience. <laughs> Um, oh man, I'm excited for this. So, quick, quick context. Um, I never, I never played through, like, the whole, like, all the story, like, the writing content of Slime Rancher 1, but I did play the game quite a bit. Um, and I, I'm a very big fan of it. Uh, I think it's so cozy. And I've booted up this game. I've, I've, I've booted up and I've run around in the, in the world in this game. Uh, Dark Zodiac, thank you for the sub. Uh, and goddamn, goddamn, this game is like, it's insane how, well, first of all, how much prettier it is than the first game. The first game was like cozy and it had like a really cute and pleasant art style. This game takes that art style and gives it fucking gram fix. Like, <laughs> this game gives it fucking gram fix. Um... So I have to start a new save file. I'll, I'll just delete this one. I didn't really... Yes. Alright. Let's, uh... Start a new one. Yeah, I will, I will say it definitely, uh, is also a case where, um... Uh, the, the new gram fix, unfortunately, raises the minimum, uh... PC spec requirements? <laughs> By quite a bit, actually. Um... And also, I've noticed, uh, this is, like, an actual, like, issue, I think, with the game. I've noticed it, like, um, there's a weird thing with the animation frame rates. Like, I run this game at, like, 60 to 120, depending on how well my PC is handling it. Um, but, like, all of the animations feel like they update at, like, 30 to 40. Is, is, like, has anyone else who's played this, like notice that discrepancy it's really weird um it's actually a little disorienting but hopefully that's something we'll like get used to um i'm just excited though it's gonna be a a, a vibe it's gonna be a vibe of a game experience perfectly available something's chugged the game bad yeah i mean ultimately this is an early access release just like the first one so like 
your mileage may vary, and also there's there's probably gonna be a Jesus, it's also pretty loud. There's there's gonna be a lot of polishing as the game goes on, I imagine. Um, so uh, let's let's get into it. Uh, so we're gonna choose. This is I mean, why anything else? You know, it's cute as fuck. Actually, do they have the bunnies in here? Yes. Okay. Now now why anything else? <laughs> Um, we're gonna enable everything, and actually I'm gonna up player damage, uh, by, like, 1.5, cause I'm a fucking gamer. No, I'm kidding. Uh, bye-bye. Um, we're gonna play normally, because, um, I respect God and God's will. Wait, I intentionally did not read this when I booted it up the first time. After a long day of slime ranching, Beatrix Lebeau was enjoying a cool glass of carrot juice as she watched the sun set across the slime sea. Suddenly, a boat arrived at her dock with nothing inside but a mysterious letter. You have explored the far, far range, from the dusty shores of the dry reef to the furthest reaches of the perilous glass desert. But there are worlds yet uncharted, Beatrix Lebeau. Rainbow Island awaits you. Climb aboard if you're ready for a new adventure. I got gays in this game? Look at that! Happy Pride Month! Beatrice excitedly boarded the boat and it took her across the slime sea. Eventually, she saw an island unlike anything on the far, far range. Mountains, trees, and grasses, all in an array of colors that danced and moved like a dream. Oh, that's why this game is so pretty. They injected it with the homosexuality. As she explored, she found an abandoned conservatory overlooking the rest of the island. Curiously, it was equipped with everything a slime rancher like her would need to wrangle slimes, start a farm, and build gadgets. She's so cute. Whoa! And so a new adventure begins. Beatrix tightened her boots, readied her backpack, and set out to explore Rainbow Island and uncover its mysteries. Pretty simple. So it's basically just like... Okay, we fucking, uh, we, we fucking pwned, we owned that entire first island, so now, uh, here's a new one. <laughs> and let's do the same shit, baby. So look at how juicy this game looks. Any reading us a bedtime story? I'm not gonna lie, that was actually the exact vibe I was going for, so, um, I hope it, I hope it helps. Uh, that's why I'm doing, that's why I'm doing this at 2.20 a.m., baby. It was all fucking premeditated. I'm literally the best, most planned and organized streamer that's ever existed. Uh, so yeah, it's just going over the basic controls right now. I'm just, I'm just, you know, sucking up all these guys. Getting some chickens in here, getting some hens in here. I just want to make sure I got all my affairs in order. Hey, you Vacto Slime! Yeah, I know, alright. Get in there. Um... Fruit veggies or chickens are used to feed slimes. Try shooting food at pink slime. They'll eat anything. I don't want to shoot this lone chicken. Do we have carrots? Do we have carrots anywhere? There might be carrots out here, but I'm afraid they'll escape here. This is kind of how I play Slime Rancher at, at the start. I'm usually like... I usually keep a pretty full backpack because I'm like... I don't have enough money to make sure that my slimes don't get away by raising the walls. And I want to keep all my slimes in, in just heavy captivity. So I'll I'll literally just like, I'll I'll be pretty, um... I'm just gonna leave it at that. Uh... Alright, we got some carrots. Oh, we got a lot. You know what? I'm actually gonna... Ooh, we have fruit? Mm -hmm. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. I have ideas so here's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna actually only take three slimes with me and he's ranch just slime alcatraz <laughs> <Slow> alcatraz <laughs> uh one two three there's fruit at gay island <laughs> holy shit we got fruits eating fruits out here let me get those, by the way. And carrots? Anything that a growing girl needs, apparently.
God, yeah, so, like... I like how... They were literally like, okay, we're making a sequel. Okay, um, let's keep the gameplay exactly the same. And just make it the prettiest fucking thing you've ever seen in your life, just as a treat. Um... Let me get some carrots in there, and then slurp up the sports. Get my money for that, because everyone needs to get paid at some point in their life. Just to understand how it feels, you know? It's what every sequel should be. You have opinions. Okay, that about covers the basics. Now it's time to get out there and explore. No matter where your adventure takes you, always keep curiosity and kindness in your heart. <laughs> no way, bitch! <laughs> Sorry. I was like, wouldn't it be funny if they asked me to be kind to somebody and I said no? But, like, the truth is... I don't think that's funny at all. There's too much of that in this sick fucking world we live in. Um, I'm curious... George... You know what? Mm, last time on, like, my test run account, I got a coop first. And honestly, that was an awful decision. So I'm going with a garden this time. Yes, I'll purchase the plot. And I'm going to put a fruit in there. Yes! Oh, look at... Whoa! I love how painterly the trunk looks. That is so pretty. Yeah, everything on this island deserves to be slurped up like a stew. Uh, oh, but now I do want a corral because I have all these chickens floating around. <laughs> That's fine, whatever. Um, no, you know what I'll do? Now it's time to just stuff that, that, that corral. Stuff that corral with these pink bitches. This pink bitch was named Breakfast! Whoa! For me! Immediately! This little pink bitch was named Slime. It was a rental, what, the chicken? They literally sound like a dog. Bam, 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 bam! Eat up, motherfuckers! Oh, I bet you're so fucking hungry, aren't you? Right, do not eat the plorts, though. Don't eat plorts. That's against God's will. And this is gonna be the most Christian playthrough of Slime Rancher. I've determined. Here, get me in there. Get me in there. No, fucker! Stay, stay out of my backpack! You don't belong just yet. Your time will come. Is there anyone more hungry than anyone else? Get the fuck out of here! You look... S who's hungry? Me! Me! <laughs> nope. You? Nope. Everyone's pretty happy. You hungry? Who's hungry? Maybe no one's hungry. That's fine. I can, uh... I can just... Go up here and go, uh... Blam, bam, blam, 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 blam. 120. That's a perfect name. Um... <clears throat> Damn it. Too expensive. Too expensive. All right, well, what now? System offline. This is this is the part of the game where it's like I, you have to fucking struggle to find out what's gonna. Oh, you know what? Why don't I go out? Why don't I go out and fucking feed wild slimes? Get some ports that way. That that's something I didn't think about when I was doing my test run. Literally. Um. I just felt like saying literally, I guess. I, I didn't have anything else to say. I think in my brain somewhere in this fucking, like, teenager's bedroom of a brain I have, like, there was gonna be something trying to... Because I, I saw the word Christian in chat, and I was like, oh, there's some there's maybe some joke about, like, warts being, like, multiplied out of... Uh, oh, these bunny ones are so cute. Oh my god, look at him. You're coming with me. <laughs> oh! Yo, you will do two of them! Yes! Uh, that's perfect. 
Bunny s cotton slimes uh, are veggie. <laughs> Guess, this game has fucking vegans? No way. Impossible. Stop! Wait, actually, that's, that's not a bad deal. Hold on. Because they will do two of them, if you remember. Wait, do they decrease in size? Whoa, no way. Hold on. Did that just happen? Did I see that correctly, or...? I don't know. Hey, idiot. Get over here. You look so hungry, it's stupid. Eat that. Maybe. Wanna eat the carrot? Eat the carrot! <laughs> the carrot, though, man! Who are you? Accessing GG log. Well, here we are again. I'm sending the drones out to all their original scouting locations. Once I confirm these conditions are the same, I'll get to work. This place, I still remember being in awe of these rainbow fields. It felt like being in a beautiful dream, and I guess in a way it was because it ended much too soon. Damn. What ended, Bay? Will you fucking eat this carrot? <laughs> I don't want to eat my carrot! Do you? Thank you, finally. Someone accepts me for who I am. Okay. Like your robot. Thank you. I appreciate it. Whoa! <laughs> Long live the king. <laughs> I, I'm completely lost. <laughs> Wait. Aha! Where the fuck am I? Hold on. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Lemmings is a different game. Yeah, I've never played Lemmings. I'm trying to live vicariously through other video games. Oh, and now they got the glow flies too. Look at you! You're a large-o, right? What do you eat? Fruit? All right, we'll come back for you later, fruity motherfucker. You can hang. Anyone so hungry they could die? You oh, I don't know if I should here. Um beep 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 get all imp in there and then how's how are my pr prices today for the oh cotton plorts are good today. Let me get those in there right away. Then tomorrow we can check our regular reports. <clears throat> Let's sleep until morning. Gross! What the fuck? Oh, they're bad. They're being bad. Hold on. Stay inside. <laughs> they're so hungry, they feel like they need... More than one carrot. They will have to make do- Oh no, never mind. <laughs> they made short work of that one. Here, uh, stay out of here. If you can't behave, you'll go back in the backpack. It's as simple as that. Why is everybody in chat talking about incinerators? You can't, you can't so, you can't pander to my sensibilities like that, okay? Oh shit, there's fruit now, and chickens! We have such a bountiful harvest. Eat up! Get in scenario that you never have to worry about feeding them again? Yeah, but like, I wouldn't make any money. Oh shit, it's new! Victor Humphreys. 
Hello? Hello? Beatrix, do you read me? Testing? Testing? Hmm. Perhaps you are lost at sea, taken away by that mysterious boat, never to be... Oh, oh no, just forgot to turn the display on. <laughs> nice to see your face again, Beatrix. I have missed you greatly, my dear friend. And while I am quite excited for you to partake in a new adventure, I already have data that might complicate things. Last night, I received a message from some sort of artificial intelligence program. It's written in code, but not one I recognize. I'm in the process of analyzing it. But I am certain thi I'm certain that this message was sent from where you are now, the mysterious Rainbow Island. So, to recap, a mysterious boat takes you to a mysterious island, and I receive a mysterious code from said mysterious island. It all seems quite... Uh, curious. Well, I've got work to do, and you best get to exploring. Oh, I almost forgot. Take this home portal. Should make the early stages of your journey easier. Take care, Beatrix. We'll be in touch. Super cool. I have friends now, which is great because, like, I don't really know how it feels normally. <laughs> Just kidding. I have a I have a bountiful support system of lovely people. <clears throat> why? I don't know why I'm. Am I describing multiple things as bountiful tonight? I'm sorry about like what that says about me on the inside. <laughs> Let me, uh, I can't, do we have enough for a coop now? Better question, if we have enough for a coop, where would I want to build it? We don't have enough for it anyway. So who's to say it even matters? Yo, this, there, we still got some rascals in here who aren't fucking satisfied with what they got. Yo, you know what? Here's, here's what I'm thinking. Would it be, like, crazy to, like, go full efficiency and just, like, do Larjos at the beginning here? But I want, like, a full corral of regular cotton slimes because they're so goddamn cute. But if we're going for full efficiency, each Larjo grants two plorts of different varieties. Hmm. Something to ruminate on. It's supposed to be a chill game, no pressure to min-max? Yeah, but like, big numbers. So... He's good, pogo fruit? Fuck yeah, they're good. They're great. Crazy how good this looks. This is very much like this is this is Slime Rancher. Like, <laughs> this is the exact same situation. No! You didn't fulfill your duty. Bam! I'm I'm having the exact same experience, uh gameplay-wise. I didn't play Slime Rancher 1, but this looks really good, so could I just jump to this or play the first one, then this one? I just, just go ahead. I mean, the first, like, it, it depends. I mean, like, someone who's more, um, invested in the story aspect of the first game will probably tell you, no, play the first one. But, like, the thing about it is that, like, I've played the first one for, I mean, probably total over the years, like, uh, you know, maybe, like, 50 plus hours. But in my most recent save file, I got to, like, 20 hours in, and, like... I had a fucking great time, and honestly, I didn't really care that much about, like... Well, I, I, not that I didn't care, but I didn't reach a lot of the story stuff, and at this point, I'm just like, I don't really play this game for the story aspect as much as I do the vibes. And I would say the vibes are very much front and center. Um, I will say, uh, like someone in chat just said, Slime Rancher 1 does, in fact, probably have, like, more content to enjoy right now, because... It's full release, and this one just came out in early access, so this one's gonna, like, expand over time. Um, but, like, if you want, if you want the game with more content, play Slime Rancher 1. Uh, if you want the game with finished content, play Slime Rancher 1. Um, 
if you're if you're just loving the vibes of this one and you want to just fuck around, and I would say you're good to you're good to jump in on this one. You're not gonna like miss out or anything because, like I was saying earlier, this is quite literally, in terms of gameplay so far, this is like the exact same experience. Um, and I say that non derogatorily. However, that's new. Large pink bonsai, lovely centerpiece to any garden. This arrangement evokes peace, calm, and the joy of pink slimes. Wait, so, wait. To build the gadget? Say F1. Sources, rich world, science. Huh. That's something I'll have to... Uh... Also, by the way, I don't, know, I don't know if I said it, but hi, Mars. Hi. It's good to see you. I think I, I think I literally just jumped right into answering your question without acknowledging that, like, hello, it's my friend in the chat. Hello. <laughs> it's good to see you. Hmm. I gotta find- I gotta learn my way around here. <laughs> this is not working out for me. <clears throat> so here's- here's what I'll do. I'm- I'm here to- I'm here to get the big numbers right away. Someone transform. Boom. <laughs> now get this. Oh wait, you just ate. Oh, but you're still hungry! You're such a chad being still hungry after just eating a little fruit. How do you do that? Oh, but not you. Not you, though. You have standards. Oh, but how about this, though? How about this? Watch this. Oh, wait. Wait. Boom. And bada boom. <laughs> Whoa! Not on my watch. No way. Not like that. Not like this. We got one fucking surf, surfing, surfing the airwaves. Okay, let's um. Oh, I just used all of my cotton plorts that I could have used to get money, but this—that's okay. This is, kids. This is you can. This is actually a replacement for business school. This is called an investment, and it's all about how you use your plorts for the better interest of having more plorts in the future. Remember to take notes, because I will not be re-explaining anything. I will expect you to retain all of it. Hmm. God, things are, like, expensive. One, one difference I think I have noticed is that I think they made, like, <laughs> the... Like, the upgrades and everything, like, monumentally more expensive right out the gate. Because, um, in Slime Rancher 1, you you can get upgrades, like, out the wazoo in your first few hours. Um, specifically for, like, your backpack and everything. If I remember correctly. Um, uh, but do we want a coop or do we want another corral? Maybe another garden. Let's get a coop. Let's get some diversity in here. Now, where's my chickens? You have been stuck here for the past 12 hours. You're free. I think backpack upgrades need plorts now, which is new. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's also, yeah. That's also what I was thinking of. They they really they like they made it a lot more of a barrier, which is which is fair. Which is fair. Um Yeah, like I said, first game was very much like in your first few hours you could get like five different backpack upgrades, I feel like. Get in there. Alright, have fun. Uh I would love to have to worry about anything, but that's okay because I am anyway. You're also stuck. You get in there. 
There's a big hen to... There's a big hen to rooster... Uh... Imbalance. <laughs> that I'm not fixing anytime soon, apparently. Hey, but that's okay. That's just more eggs. That's more babies in there. Which means... More, more guys. Um... And 60% of them will be fed <laughs> to another creature. So don't get too attached. Wham, wham. Actually, you know what? You three. <laughs> Your time has come. Wham, wham, wham. Very sick. And I don't mean in the heinous way. Is there a third uneaten chicken in here? No, actually. Two normal pink slimes got to them first. That just won't do. That's uncouth. Me, when I don't know what uncouth means. Okay. So this is my science room. Fabricator allows you to craft vac upgrades and gadgets using resources stored in the refinery. Give it a try. Yeah, so... Adds a resonator to the vac suction mechanism. Ten cotton ports. Yeah, these are... Oh, these are so expensive. Oh my god. You need 1,500 bucks? Brock, thank you for the five dollars. I appreciate it. You need 1,500 bucks. For an extra slot? And 450 for the I can't even do water yet? Oh man. Yellow home portal. Oh shit, wait. Don't we have one of these already? Gadget mode. T. Whoa! Yeah, 15 smackaroons. This fruit needs to go faster. I'm so unsatisfied with my life. <laughs> wasn't even a logical fall. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna put, um... Oh shit, what are you? <gasps> Whoa! Cool! Dude! Oh, he just gave me the recipe for a portal? That's fucking useless. Now I gotta go out here and literally harvest money. I'm scraping by. I can't even afford McDonald's. I've never known the sweet fucking succulents of a McChicken. Yo, by the way... Remember how, I think it was last stream, YOU ARE SPECIAL! Woo! Remember how it was last stream, I think, or at least it was a recent stream, where I, I was like, guys, I've never had a Big Mac in my life. Um, and then I was also like, I'm thinking of ordering a Big Mac right away. Um... Oh, that's cool! That's actually really helpful. Um... I tried a Big Mac for the first time. You know what? Actually kind of ruled. It's it's definitely cat. Come back for you later. It's definitely um It's definitely McDonald's. You know, it's not much too different from your standard like McDonald's burger situation. Um but it's just nice and like 
It's just got some stuff going on to it, you know? It, it hits. It's like it's got a pretty good balance of shit that hits. Um, so now I've officially had one <laughs> in, my, in my entire 24 years on this godforsaken earth. Um, I've had one Big Mac. And it's not gonna become a regular thing, but sometimes I can I could probably see myself craving it sometimes. And there we go. McDonald's hit me up. Right away. Now would be a great time to have that portal that I thought we already had. Cause I straight up don't know where the hell we're going. It's so pretty at night though. Okay, they've upped. They've upped the nighttime vibes like crazy. The nighttime vibes are simply unmatched. Look at this big motherfucker! Eat up, bitch! Where's more vegetals? I would love more vegetals for this guy. No, get out of here, you stupid chicken! Who asked? <laughs> yes, yes, vegetals. Yes, it's. I'm like that. I'm like that poem that the little girl wrote about the the lion <laughs> escaping from its cage. What about vegetals? Yes. Yes! The vegetals are free! Wham! Now explode. I'm begging you. Oh, look at that! This is- this is actually a really cool gameplay mechanic because they've added little freaks and motherfuckers that will jump in front of the mouth of the big- big chungus and potentially block your feeding efficiency. No! <laughs> sorry. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Oh my god. I you know, sometimes I really need to calm down. <laughs> I, like, sometimes I feel like I take things too seriously. Let me get home. I gotta. I gotta. Uh. Oh! <laughs> the problems. Wham! 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 You done yet? Wham! Come on. Which one? Which one is gonna be the straw in that camel's back? Which one is gonna be the straw on that camel's back of a tummy you got? You are not ready. You are not ready. I haven't been- I haven't been- Carrots. In a long time. Explode. Go. Go to hell. Yes! Uh, say hello to my mother. What the fuck? What? Okay. Bunch of those. Oh, shit! It was hiding, like, a pathway? Um, by the way, I want to rescind what I said about say hello to my mother. Uh, I actually just saw my mother today in real life. <laughs> Not a joke. Um, and I love her very much, and I just want everybody to- to be on the same page. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Hello? Ancient ruins? That's so cool. This is interesting. What are you doing? You've become interesting. I'm going. I'm heading out. Okay, Miss Fritz, I'm about to head out. What 
the hell? Dude, this music is good too, by the way. What is this? Whoa! Starlight Strand, a vision of dusk and dawn to get... No fucking way. Oh my god. Dude. That's... what? It, oh, my I was like, what the fuck is that? That's an arm. That? <laughs> you know what that looks like? Wait, come on. Fucking out... The fucking outbound ghost page. Hold on. This is this is what hold on. Shit, oh my god. I fucking hate WebP. Whoever decided WebP was a thing, give me your address, I just wanna talk. Uh, you know what this reminds me of? <laughs> Don't tell anybody. <laughs> An unknower, thank you so much for the sub, I appreciate it. Where am I? I'm so far away. This is so pretty. I can go anywhere I want and be anything I want to be. Tell me I'm wrong. <laughs> I'm begging you. Okay, but we got a lot of the same freaks over here, so... Um, I'm going back. At least this is here forever, I assume. Nice little teleport move. What is this? Hold on. Hello? Wee. <laughs> she wore a crown and she came down in a bubble, dog. Grow up, bro. You're gonna look at me and tell me that I'm wrong? Fucking, yeah, World Heritage video. Ah! Jump scare. Ah! Jump scares all around. I didn't know this was a horrors game. Oh, my, my, my slimes are probably just in shambles. <laughs> oh, no! Here's a life hack, though. If I never come back, they'll never escape. They won't even be loaded in the game's VRAM. <laughs> Yo, I love how the corral gate looks at night. That's so cool. Oh. How we doing on money-wise? Ooh, I'm gonna get- Okay, let me get the money from these first. Then I'll go to sleep. You're so mad. Shit. No better. Oh well. At least there's 20 of them. At least the, the cotton plorts are still high value. Oh. Oh. Stay out of here. Stay out of here. Who has not been fed? Who is not satisfied? No! No freedom. No freedom! Oh no! One more time and you will be sent to punishment. I hope you realize. Get 
out of here, man. This is so inefficient. <laughs> oh, I straight up don't have room. Here. I probably have enough for a plort collector, right? God damn it. I almost have enough here. Now I have enough for a plort collector. God, those cotton plorts are crazy. Please, save my life. I'm begging you. Yes. Yes. The lion is free. You still can't, to this day, you still cannot put the same type of plort in two different slots. Immersion broken. Well, I, I love it when they, like, circle around you like that. That shit is so cool. Why can't you collect more than 20? Because I'm a fucking baby. I don't have enough money to do better in life. a tragic tale. Most babies are. <laughs> Alright. My final decree. I don't have enough. Never mind. <laughs> it's... Ah, it's all falling apart. We have a new message, though. You've got mail. Ochi Miles? Well, what do you know? Beatrix LeBeau off on another adventure and didn't think to take her good pal, sometimes rival, forever mentor Mochi Miles. Seriously, B, next time you go off running, off, next time you go running off to dangerous, uncharted territory, do you at least give me a heads up? I'd like to be there for you in case you need me to help collect all those valuable resources that seem to be scattered all over the island. What? You think I wasn't gonna do a little recon of my own? What good are surveillance satellites if they can't snoop on stuff? Anyway, be careful out there. Island gives me a kind of weird vibe, so I'm gonna keep poking around. Oh, and since I know you're starting from scratch out there, take this refinery link. It should make things easier for you. I'll just put it on your tab. Later, later. Later, tater. You're a potato. Refinery. Thank Yo, shit, wait, maybe actually we do have the stuff they gave us. I just have it, I have it in like a weird chest of some kind that I haven't activated. Perhaps, perhaps. Hmm. Well, that's not it. That's just the thing I use to spin things on. Arthur Morgan? When did you get here? I just came in the other day. Dude. Oh, okay, never mind. It's all kind of shit. Sunlight! How are y'all doing? Pretty good? Alright, cool. I'm glad that the chickens don't need to eat anything. all very useful for me. It's a good system. Okay, uh, we got shit to do. Let's head out again. It's gonna, um... It was Arthur Morgan like Slime... Yeah, Arthur Morgan from Red Dead Redemption 2. Do you like Slime Rancher? It's not really my thing, but I can... I can get behind it. Cool. Yeah, you know, I, I kind of expected that. Yep. Uh, Arthur Morgan? Yep. Uh, Arbaku in chat asks, Hi Arthur Morgan, what's your favorite slime? <laughs> well, 
my true f f favorite slime is maybe not appropriate to talk about on stream. God damn it, Arthur Morgan. Get the fuck out of here with your M-rated video game shenanigans. At least he respects the Twitch terms of service. As an outlaw, you think you would- WHERE ARE YOU GOING?! No. Alright, next person who pulls that shit. Remember, on thin ice. Slurp it up, Sally. Slurp it up. Slurp it up, Sally. Serve it up. Mm -mm, like all your French toast. What is the Skull Gang for <laughs> Game Spider-Man 2000 do a thing in Slime Richard do? I don't know, hey, hey, Skull Gang. Hey! Um, what do you think of Slime Rancher 2? Gah! Oh, shit. It does it, are the graphics to, they, do the graphics maybe hurt your eyes like with all the bloom and stuff? Circus? What? What are you talking about? The f wants to play. Wait, what? Wants to play. Are you saying you want to play Slime Rancher 2? Ah! What? I'm trying. I'm doing my best. Hey, you wants to play. I mean, yeah. In a way. I, I, I already am playing, though, so I feel like that desire is maybe kind of satisfied. Get up. What? Get up. Wants to play. Are you telling me to get up because... <laughs> get up, chump. Wants to play. Get up. No, I'm not getting up. Gah! Yeah, yeah, you can yeah, stay mad, motherfucker. Eat. Give me money by feeding. Alright, we're about to have enough for an expansion. Everyone's so happy. Awesome. Okay. Any get out of here. Let you really would rather the Skull Gang from hit video game Spider-Man 2002 play Slime Rancher 2 on stream than me on my stream. You know they fucking killed Uncle Ben. Oh shit! Wait, no, they didn't. Sandman did. Went Marco. From Spider-Man 3. Killed Uncle Ben. Okay, uh, what can we create? Uh, internet, solar shield. What can I do? I feel like I want to do something else. Like, a lot of that is pretty good to go right now. So let me just, uh... Hmm. I thought it said anger plort. Battery plort, boom, boom plort. Okay, some of these are similar. Oh, I thought it was like a weird potion plort. Eat brine, strange diamond, radiant ore. Okay, cool. Interesting. Buzzwax. <laughs> okay. Uh, resource harvester. Adds a resonator to the vac suction mechanism that shakes loose science resources from nodes in the environment. No Why is he nodes like that? <laughs> nodes. Yo, they shake nodes from the environment, yo. Alright, Mange. I never die in Slammer. 
Um, energy boost, dash boots, get pack, tank booster. Oh man, that'd be pretty good. But we need cats. And like, who's who needs that? You know. Hmm. I mean, resource harvester is a pretty good deal. I think that'll maybe like get us some some progress progress but i just don't know i got all this money burning a hole in my pocket i'm saying ouch ouch stop out out shit stop stop that stop setting my pants on fire i haven't lied in so long what the fuck is this adventure awaits Ah! Uh. Hello? It's the boat. Ah! <laughs> oh no. Boat, the boat was a red herring. <laughs> Yo, holy shit. Wait, are they all Barjos now? When did that happen? I straight up, I'm... Man. I missed my kids growing up. <laughs> Been too busy working. Wait. Better idea. Watch this shit. Wait. Fuck. Hold on. Oh, I don't know. I need the solar shield. God sh darn it. I don't have enough for that. That's okay. Watch this. Wham! Everybody eat up. It's important for you. I'm going to sleep. Did I just sleep two days in a row by accident? Oh, dude, fuck this, man. <clears throat> you know what? Who needs it? New plan. I was gonna put some... I was gonna put some phosphor slimes in there. Maybe, maybe spruce up my garden. Whee! Um... But instead, I, why am I filling up my back? I'm literally going out for, you know what? Oh, you are interesting. Yes. I just got money for being so smart. Anyway, I, I need a different kind of slime now. I don't need the cotton slimes just yet. I do want a corral specifically for cotton slimes because I just love their fucking vibes. Um, but I do want to get some more... Some more diverse... Uh, diversified income sources. <laughs> like you! What the hell is going on in there? Are you the same one? Oh, shit. Accessing GG log. I was so in over my head when I first started here. I remember hauling jelly stone back to the conservatory by hand. 
because I was so excited, breathless, and sweating. I was going about everything all wrong, but I was happy. There's little time now, so I'll need these refinery things if I'm going to be efficient. This time, I'm going to do it right. Omni Badass, thank you so much for gifting two tier one subs. I appreciate it a ton. How many cats are in the soup? Why would you put your cats in the soup? That's really dangerous for them. They're not supposed to be in there. I recommend you take them out and put them somewhere else. Perhaps. <laughs> oh, this is an adventurous world where phosphorus slimes and regular slimes can coexist! This is truly a world of great tidings. The tidings of great joy that will be to all people. Oh, shit. Oh, no, this is too adventurous. Where are the cats? Where are the fucking cats? Mate. I seem to remember seeing a couple fucking cats around here. So I was thinking of something else. Dude, that movie, that movie got weird at a certain point. <laughs> hey, I do mean weirder than just it. Right up, where are the cats? Cats, cats, where are the cats? Who's that? Hello! Straight up. <gasps> ah! Yes! Tabby, 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 tabby! Woohoo! What is this? Stop! Oh, okay, it worked. <laughs> And there's more! Yes! Oh my god, look at me go. What the fuck? Oh, you are a problem! Get out of here! <laughs> no! Oh shit! Marco told his raid with party 81. Hi, Mar! Thank you so much! For some reason, my raid notification isn't working on the new. Uh. I've, I've changed some of my overlay and, like, alert assets and stuff. It's all fucked right now, so I'm getting everything working. Thank you so much, though. I appreciate the raid. Thank you. I hope you had a good time. Team Grub is the best, bub. It's so fun that, like... What I really appreciate about our friendship is that you can just be so heinously wrong. And I still love you. Like, I look down on you for sure, but, like... It's, it's like it doesn't stop friendship from happening. <laughs> I haven't even, no, you know what? I totally, I think I did pick a Splatfest team. I just haven't played uh, during the Splatfest, but uh, I, I'm, I'm team gear because it's the correct choice. You can do anything with gear. Hey! <laughs> Fred! Fuck this big, big motherfucker in this cave that just yells fruit. What is this?
I think... Listen, I actually... I really appreciate that they've added... Um, I really do appreciate these three-way Splatfests. I think it's really important to add a third tier such as fun for uh, all the people who play Splatoon who are like spineless cowards. It's, it's like really good for like accessibility, I think. I'm sorry I'm being toxic. I don't mean it except for when I do. They're gonna break this fucking net and I'll deserve every second of it. Um. <clears throat> well, the ironic thing is that I think now I have enough to get the... No, I didn't. Okay. I up! Uh... 12.50 something. Is that noon? I gotta kill time until noon with these prices? No way. Wham, wham, wham. Eat up. Eat up, buttercup. Bam. Sick. All right. Man, why didn't I put, um... Why didn't I just put a net on this one? <laughs> oh, it's because that one sh was shorter, but <laughs> why would I have made that one? Oh, man. I could maybe just, like, switch them around. Hmm. It'll be a bit of a project, but we'll see. Fun? Wham, 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 wham. Oh, shit. Oh. Project not needed. <laughs> anymore. Yo, these guys are about to fucking revolt. Let me get some fruit for them. Some fruit and veggies. A well-balanced diet should be just what they need. Get some money while we're at it, too. Yo, you know what? Hold on. Hmm. Have ideas. When you come crying because you want to join our game of Uno on the island, you're not invited. Uh, yeah, because I'll be the one fucking like building shelter that you can play your Uno game in. What the fuck are you gonna do if it starts raining and your cards get all soggy? Oh no, your cards are falling apart. I wonder if maybe having like some fucking like shelter would have been a good decision. No, sorry. I have to like, I have to like satiate my short attention span for like two seconds. Despite the fact that it's not at all productive to survivability on this goddamn island. It's ridiculous. It's childish. Short-sighted. Deplorable behavior. <laughs> also, like, st straight up, straight the fuck up, I'm telling you this right now. I can make whatever goddamn games I want with gear. Like... That's- that's the thing, right? Is like, it's gear, grub, or fun. Gear entirely facilitates the other two. I, like, it's a fucking no-brainer.
I mean, we can make a card castle for shelter. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's a great idea. Yeah, and I'm sure the fucking... I'm sure the first two little pigs really thought they had it all figured out, too. But, you know, that... That wolf comes around. And every, everybody's like, Oh, how could we have foreseen this? That fruit, fuck that piece of fruit in particular. <laughs> you know what? Take it back. And he's toxic gamer arc. I just can't, I just can't put up with this anti-intellectual nonsense. We need more thinkers in our society, <laughs> not less. <laughs> cool. So someone just said like exactly what I said in chat, but replaced the word thinkers with fingers. So super cool. <laughs> Slime named Finger. Eat your goddamn transformation berry. Eat up. I'm begging you, please. Are you satisfied? How? I could never be. What do you know that I don't? How are prices today? Awful. Yes! Oh, very good. That's exactly what I'm looking for. That's exactly what Mama ordered. Wham! Okay, well that didn't happen. Maybe this one will. Oh. Maybe this one will- Yes, sir! Yes, sir! You're so resourceful with the situation that life has given you. Okay, we'll leave it at there for now. And I'm gonna spend the rest of these on money. <clears throat> oh, you are suffering. I'm so sorry. Here you go. Please have carrots. I'm begging you. Oh, fuck. There's so many pink ones. I don't need gear to make a fire or spell out help on the beach. I am not strong, will not be able to free it. differentiate what is and is not poison when foraging or hunting. Plus, even if I could, I would not be able to stomach it because of sensory issues. With grub, I can stave off starvation without fucking exhausting myself. It's fair, but also, like, you wouldn't want the possibility of having, like, a flare on you. <laughs> like, you don't need to, like, Spell out help on the beach. Okay, I'm going to bed. sound like ridiculous oh i'm so sorry about what's happening over there oh there are plenty of you <laughs> wham, 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 wham. then let's get the Maybe not. I was gonna say, let's get the pork collector. Nope. Let's first get some money in the bank.
God, this game is so fucking chill. I love it. Oh, yes, everything is good today. Everything is so good. Today is the day we fucking go crazy. Yes! Uh, look at this. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna collect these. Oh, get them all in there. Oh, fuck yeah. Yeah, Wahoo is right. Even they know. Even they know. Big fucking money! Look at that! 900 smackaroons! Sure I got everything? Okay. Good to go. These guys can eat veggies too? Oh, crazy. Actually... Now that now that now that I've said that, this is the perfect opportunity. To make another garden, and we have exactly one carrot. Boom. And not a carrot in the world about it. Woo! Get in there. Um. All right, and so. For these garden plots, I I'm I want speed for speed for this one. Can't get any other ones right away, but that's okay. Then I was going to say maximum harvest for this one, probably. Let's see if anyone else here is hungry. Can anyone else here eat? Anyone else here have an appetite? That's right, yes you do. Yes, you absolutely do. The game looks so nice as if it's like the second stream of this. No, this is, this is the first. My first run. Um... That being said, I don't actually know how consistent of a stream staple this is going to be, especially with, like, the five other things I need to stream in the near future. It is uh, and I'm going to set this expectation up front, it is just as likely this will be the only time I stream this game until, like, months from now. Um... I, yeah, yeah, no, truly a Wobble Dogs moment. This honestly might just be a thing where, like, I, I do, like, a, a check-in every so often. Um, as much as I would love to just, like, do this constantly, because this is such a good vibe, um, like, I have, like, I, I already have, like, I, I have God of War and soon fucking fairly odd parents and alan wake taking up the tuesday and wednesday slot which are the only times i guaranteed stream a week or as close to a guarantee as you can get with me um and then i have the last of us for the most part filling out the bonus stream slot except for this week i think unless i decide to stream on monday which i honestly might do just to get more last of us in this week but um, like, I got those three happening. Or those four, because I listed off, like, four games, I think. So that's, like, that's all of my regular stream slots. Unless I literally started streaming, like, every weekday. <laughs> I, like, could not, I couldn't fit this in. I couldn't fit this in. Unless it was literally just, like, a whenever the fuck I randomly feel like it. But also soon, I'm going to be working on getting, uh footage compiled for the Kingdom Hearts dub. Um, so, like, I'm gonna be spending a lot more energy during the day than I have been for the last few weeks. Which might then compromise how frequently I can stream. So it's like, you know. I true I have no clue, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm just setting the expectation that, like, I'm gonna get as much out of this as I can during this session because having a great time, and I want to see as much of it, and I want to, like, broadcast as much of it. But also, to be fair, this is a lot more, like, straightforwardly just, like, Slime Rancher 
than I think I maybe expected. So I figure it's a case where like kind of it it it's kind of it says on the tin <laughs> what the rest of this experience is gonna basically be like in terms of um vibes and gameplay loop. Well, I mean, it'll get, like, monumentally more complicated. Um, anyway. Ogden Ortiz. Hola, Beatrix! Are you there? It's me, Ogden Ortiz. I hear you're off on a big new adventure on a mysterious island filled with secrets in danger and maybe a few succulent fruits or veggies the world has never seen before. Do you know I had to ask? Ever since you got me a steady supply of cook adobo fruits, I've been reaching for even greater culinary heights within the far, far range. I don't know what this accent is. Yeah, I, I was going for like a Russian thing at first, but then it went like somewhat Scottish. I don't know. It's kind of just happening. Uh, plus, I'm getting pretty tired of eating cook adobo pie. Cook adobo souffle, cook adobo pudding, cook adobo con carne, cook adobo co uh, cook adobo. I'm running out of ideas and willpower. So if you see something new, please tell me about all about it. Tasty treats aside, I want to know all about the new flora and fauna you discover. Never forget, every bit of this wild world is precious and worth our care and respect. And stay hydrated out there. All that adventuring will work up a sweat, so take this water tap. Okay, yeah, alright, it sounds like Gru. Alright, I get it. <laughs> you fucking, you fucking rose. You, you did it. You got me. Now I can't do the voice anymore. I hope you're happy. Good luck, Beatrix. Keep me posted. I'm rooting for you. A water. What did we get? Dude, this, I will say, the whole, like, science, like, inventory system in this game is still obtuse as fuck. Why do I have to... Why do I have to press F1 to bring up the Slimepedia when, like, the I button doesn't do anything. <laughs> he is gadget mode. I don't know what the fuck that's about. Abilities. Portable water tap. It's a refreshing water spring. Well, I can't do anything with water at the moment. So, what even for? I should start putting stuff in the refinery, I think. Oh, they're so hungry. I wish I could help, but I'm apathetic. I simply do not know how to fix this. Yeah! Wham, wham, wham! Fucking jump feeding attack! Wham! Is that it? One of each? Really? Y'all haven't eaten? Eat up! Eat the carrots! Oh, there's more. Okay. They were just up in the air. Oh, 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 here comes another. Come on, come on, come on. Boom. There we go. Um. I have so many chickens. Oh, there's so many of you, too. Roots are done, actually. Oh, I maybe should wait for the fruits to fall more often, maybe, potentially. Oh, they're they're still coming. More? More yet even? Who's to say? Wham wham wham! Eat up! Can't you burn them alive or like put them in the oven? Is that were people being serious when they were talking about the incinerator? I thought y'all were joking. Wait, can you be fucked up in this game? What in the heck in hell? What for? <laughs> to what end? 
You know what? I'm for speed. Us joke about slime? Well, it's more likely than you think. can incinerate slimes, fortunately. Who is telling the truth? <laughs> you know what? I don't even want to know. I'll figure it out. Yo. Yo, some of these motherfuckers are aged. You gotta get out of here. You gotta go. <laughs> Alright. Bye. Damn, that speed upgrade fucking did the job. Okay. Uh, let me think. What do I want next? You know what? I'll start putting some of these ports in the refinery. that hen. Eat that hen sitting in the corner. She's trying to get out. She can't escape. Show her that. Show her that it's fruitless. It's no use. <laughs> Is no one hungry for this little thing? Yes. Yes. I heard the crunch. I heard the fucking Chuck E. Cheese ticket muncher. Yes! Uh, that's what I'm talking about. I think that actually is the Chuck E. Cheese Ticket Muncher sound. But to the degree of one. <laughs> That's what it sounds like, right? Okay, we'll put uh, four of these in here. One, two, three, four. Four of these, five of these, five of these. I'm comfortable with that. To what end, though? Just for the fabricator? Yes. Aha! There we go. Five out of ten. What's a useful utility? Yellow home portal could do us well if I knew however the even fuck to get these. Oh, that's probably what the... Oh, that's what the resource harvester is for. Okay, that's that's next priority. Actually, and I think if we... If we just put five more in here and then sell the rest of these, we'll be good to get that. War! Said Wario. Cool. Okay. Now I can grab other things. Whoa. Okay, then what else? Warp tech. Okay, don't really need that. This have an actual gameplay function. I would love to know. Uncertain. Portable water tap again, don't really need right now because I can't even grab water to begin with. What is, how much is that gonna cost? 
Jesus Christ. Just nickel and dime me for everything, why don't you? Okay. I don't have enough to feed my kids, but I have enough to make you feel better, so... Who won? Who's next? You decide. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, these slimes, these slimes get so pink in sunset. Who's hungry? Sleep. Sleep until morning. Sleep until day. Sleep all your fucking little troubles away. Don't you know it's the best thing to do when you're sleepy, sleepy, and you're creepy? <laughs> I don't know what that. Why am I shooting ports everywhere? That's not what I wanted. Buttons got all crossed up. I'm I'm officially just like, oh, I'm in it. <laughs> my my energy has gone down, but like in a good way. No! Oh, that's better. Okay. I'll probably make up the difference overall. No, it won't. That's not how math works. That's okay. Bing, 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 bong, bong, bong. Circle around me like a tornado's. Okay. Let's look on the plort chart. What's... What's big profit today? Oh, lava plorts would be great. I don't know what the angle... Oh, you know... No, that's phosphor plorts, so what the fuck is angle? Water plorts are crazy right now. You know what? I'm pretty sure... No, we saw rock plorts, which honestly are also crazy right now. I'm going to rock place. Wait. First. Dialogue. Beatrix, I've done it! I believe I've cracked the superior mysterious code- or the- I can't read. I believe I've cracked the super mysterious code that was sent to me. It was astoundingly complex. I believe that the AI that created this code displays a comparable intellect to my own. So very advanced. Just alien. Oh, you're probably wondering what it said. Well, I determine this mysterious, perhaps even alien AI sent a message that says... Hello. <laughs> Not much, but pleasantries count for something. More importantly, though, the moment I cracked it, I received another message. It's almost as though this mysterious AI is monitoring me. How exciting! I haven't decrypted it yet, but the code is considerably more complex. This should be fun! Well, back to work as ever. Man, I'm used to, um... I'm used to the system where it's like... They ask you for favors. What happened to that one? I really liked that. I thought that was a cool thing. I kind of miss it. Everybody's old and soon will die. That's okay. Why even cry? Ran out of favors to ask. True. Wham, 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 wham. And then even more of a wham. Wait, what do rock slimes eat? No? Shit. I should have confronted them sooner. Alright, we gotta head out, because 
We're wasting daylight. Okay, so if I remember correctly, we have to go into that crazy place with the light. Uh, the, we have to go to the hive swap place. Ah! No! I need meat! <laughs> Eat a vegetable instead for once in your goddamn life. You don't need more protein. That's why when you leave the house, you always have to take one chicken with you. Really important life lesson. Always just one. Yo, man. I could have had it all figured out. Stony hen. Stony pony. Dude, are we talking horses? Come on, give me the big money. Gotta be a big money guy around here somewhere. I I don't I don't know where I am. This is cool though. We got another one of these crazy portal things around here. Oh shit! That maybe has something to do with one of the one of the big. And rounds. Yeah, new new map is legitimately stunning. I feel like it can it cannot be said enough. Oh, here we are. I, I knew from the moment the trailer dropped in one of those Xbox showcases, I was like, holy shit, the new, like, the updated art style is just fucking uncalled for, <laughs> but in the best way possible. All right, I'm getting rid of this stony hen. Go smoke weed somewhere else. It's collecting a bunch of ya. <laughs> By the way, uh, this is where, when and where can I make use of this new fucking upgrade that I got for, uh, like picking a cube fruit? Love those. We got all the classics coming through. Who the hell are you? Cotton Hunter Larjo. Oh, you are. Oh, okay. You're mad. Got it. Eat up, bitch. Eat. Eat! You are hungry. Eat. Yeah. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. You still feral? Like William? Still feral? Like, yeah, eat some more, motherfucker. You got it. Eat up. Yo, actually, I actually don't think- Yo, I think this is actually just how you normally look. Alright. You are literally coming home. You're coming back with me, I don't care, I'm keeping you. I will- I will carry you all the way back. Can I take you through the portal? Yes. Yes. Oh, this is, hold on. This is, 
Bad on the... Okay, that's better. He was shaking too much. What if it eats cotton, guys? It won't. It's it's His diet is veggie and meat. Slimes don't eat other slimes. slimes. They only eat other slimes' plorts. Everybody jumped at the same time. That was so coordinated. We're so cool. We're very cool. We're very cool and we're figuring things out. Very cool and we're getting it together. Okay. So I'm gonna have to be pretty... Pretty resourceful here. Uh... So... Okay. Uh... Wait. Okay. Well... And... <sighs> high walls? Yeah, high walls for the big boy. Oh shit, I built it around you! Look at that! Oh. How about it? Okay, and then... One more corral. For all these... Rock slimes! We eat vegetables! Yes, and they're so good at eating vegetables. They they go invisible. That's so cool. Oh, but we could easily lose track if we're not careful. Got to be careful. Um Let's I want to just really quickly make sure we have enough to keep this guy in here as much as possible. Yeah, eat up, eat up, eat up. How are y'all doing on the... Oh, you've left me plenty of ports. I appreciate this. Here we go. This is where shit starts, like, happening. I can feel it. The, the gameplay loop is settling in. Wham, 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 wham. Wham, 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 Okay. Really quick. You guys can have your fruits. There you go. Get all that out of your system. Give me as many of these as possible for me. I would like to have them in my backpack. I would like to have them as a tree. Okay. Everything's still okay over here? No escapage just yet? Okay. Oh, but they're trying. They're getting real close, actually. Uh, make sure... That doesn't happen. Oh, yeah, they're stacking up on each other. You are truly very resourceful. It's impressive. I'll give you that. I'll give you that. Uh, some veggies, some veggies, some veggie, veggie, veggies. And everybody gets in here. Forts and all. Just doing this efficiently so I can always slap you all back out. Oh. Okay. That's... I thought you were gone for a second. You can't freak me out like that. Okay, let's get the let's get these plorts in here, cause oh, that's gonna be so much money. Aya! Boom! And now, now we can get an air net for this motherfucker. Yes, dude, look at that. Can we even get something else for some of these? Plort collector. For that, but that's for later. Cabby plort. Uh, I'm sure, it's got all of them. Okay. These. Hell yeah, yeah, we're in stonks mode. Okay, how y'all doing? You've got plenty. You've got lots of ports to pick up. And fruits are about to come down. Oh man, now it's like... I went I went exactly from having too little to work with to having like way too much all at once. Oh, I was... You hungry at all? With love. Okay, that's fine. That'll be there for you though, when you need it. 
get a plort collector in here. Auto feeder. Auto feeder would be very useful for one of these, but first things first. I'm gonna get another garden going. Wait, is there a better space for this, maybe? Eh, not really. Yeah, we're kind of using up everything. Okay. Let's get this over here, then. Garden! And... Dewberry! Yes! Uh, <gasps> look! Hunterplort. How much do those go for right now and also in general? Oh, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. So here's what we'll do. Here's what we'll do. We're gonna we're gonna fucking do some experimenting in the morning. We're gonna make more of these sons of bitches. Uh, someone in here gets a cuberry. I don't know who. Figure it out. Okay, so let's go to sleep. Everybody good to go? No, you're suffering. Okay, let's let's figure that out. Let's figure that out. We can deal with that. We can deal. That's exactly 20. Uh, you need either veggie or meat. Don't worry, I got plenty of veggie. Y'all need veggies for sure. So actually, I'll get some, uh, I'll get some chickens here. Some veggies for y'all. Okay. You need veggie or meat here. You can have a veggie. that up later. Uh, and let me get some chul <laughs> some chickens. Jesus Christ, there are way too many. I would love if you were not on the other side of this. Thank you. I'll feed you some meat. Dude, and the cuberries are already grown? How the hell did that happen? This is, stuff's too crazy. I need another... I need another plot for storage. That's what I need. Oh! How much do these cost? Okay, we're getting... We're getting pretty close to the point where I should have enough to, like... Oh, someone's getting rowdy. You gotta stop bumping the air net. I need... I need a storage plot. Is there any... Is there, like, one extra plot anywhere? Yo, could I, like, build a plot somewhere? Utilities, warp tech, decorations. Fuck. Okay, well, let's, let's go full profit. Hold on. I still, I still need to experiment here. Okay, all the cuberries can go in here. Because here's what I'm going to do. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna grab some more bunnies, at least two, and I'm gonna feed them these hunter plort. And just have another, another group of hybrids in there. Yes, perfect. Get in there, you get in there, perfect. Freshly, freshly brewed slime. So we just have just like a, a stream of Diverse plort-based income constantly coming in. Because we can also sustain it. We have a lot of different foods going on. You guys are not satisfied with your situation and your lot in life. That's okay. That can change. Bam, bam. You eat this. You eat this. Come on. Hey. Eat this. Hey. Boom. There we go. Pick that up. Awesome. Veggies and meat. Oh, they're hungry. Oh, they're so hungry. Hold on. We can fix that. We can fix that. Boom. Boom. Yeah. See? It's all good. I don't need to freak out. Some... Oh, you're not freaking out anymore, actually. Okay. All good. 
So this little guy is in here for when you're ready to feed again. Where did I support? Oh, okay. Your attachment to the original pink bunnies is holding you back. Replace them. Why? I mean, yeah, they're not super, like, high profit, I guess. You know what? You kind of have a point. We could get some crazy combinations going on. What the fuck are we still doing getting pink plorts? Like, yeah, there's a lot of them, but at what cost, man? Look at this! I gotta do this just to get by. We'll, we'll, we'll consider the considerations. What other crazy combinations could we have? Honestly, these rock slimes could be combos in and of themselves. Yeah, it's pushing it, though. Should we have, like, only combinations? I mean... I mean, if we want to see regular-ass slimes, we can see plenty of them out on the world. Why are we sitting here, like, being conservative with who we keep and harvest, you know? Did I say harvest? I didn't. Prices are good today. Well, except for rock plorts, but that's still 47 per. Hunter plorts are good today. Rock hunter? Yeah, but hunters go invisible. I don't want all these guys to be going invisible. I think I can deal with like three invisible ones, but past that it gets a little egregious. I need to just like feed cats <laughs> something. Okay. All the chickadoos. Get to live because you're children. But you're on thin ice, <laughs> also. Also, the hunters. I don't. I don't want to deal with too many hunters because the hunters also get like way too crazy when they're hungry. Like they do not handle hunger pretty well. You know? So it's like, how, how much of that do I really want to be dealing with all at once? Pink slimes are old and outdated. Yeah, you're not wrong. We could get next year's model. <laughs> Why be you and you can be new? What the f Oh man, don't appeal to me with the robot robots quotes. That's that's right to my influence bone. Okay. I just realized we have twenty four. <laughs> Hundred gold. So we're probably doing pretty okay at the moment, all things considered. Okay. What do I want to do? We could start getting wacky. And hey, you know what? I think it's time to diversify. What do we got? We got bunny tabbies. So we got rabbit, cat, rock, hunter, bunny. We got a lot of bunnies. We need to we need to get outside the bunny thing. Not that I don't like bunnies, don't get me wrong. It's just it's too much. It's too much going on. We like we have plenty we have plenty of bunnies. We can maybe we can combine the rocks with something else, I think, next. Something maybe a little 
more agreeable. Not so crazed. Speaking of... What I'll do for these guys and for the rocks... I'll buy them some music boxes. To really... Mellow them out a little bit. Hopefully. What do I have the most of in terms of food? I have a lot of chickens for food. So what I'll do is, uh... Gee, me, there's a lot of you in here. So I'm gonna buy... an auto-feeder for you. And just stick all these. That'll be at the medium rate. That seems agreeable. Let's sell all the plorts we got. I definitely need an auto feeder for you just when I have something to put in there. seem pretty happy. That's the thing about those guys. Like, yeah, they're a little boring and they're maybe over representing the bunny plorts, but, like, also they really are just so agreeable. They're easy to please, you know? They seem pretty happy, unlike these guys who are constantly fucking stacking up on each other, which, by the way, uh, stop. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Sure, right? Okay. But, alright. Let's, uh, let's brainstorm a little bit. Get some of these out of here. So, um, what could, what can we combine with the rocks? What slimes have we seen that we haven't got? Nothing. We need to, like, interact with a slime in order to catch it. So, let's head, let's head out. Alright, Miss Fritz. So, oh wait, let me take some veggies back. The rocks first. God, these type these games are so all oh, these games are so bad for my brain, but also so good. I I fall for the gameplay loop of like, oh actually before I do this, let me do this. Spends one and a half hours doing the thing I said I would do before doing something else I meant to do first. for later. Oh shit, it's almost sundown. It is sundown. <laughs> Sun is going down. Um, let's sleep first. And then wake up to like just a shit ton more maintenance we have to do right away. That's gonna distract me from the one thing I've been trying to get done for the past like 20 minutes. Y'all are mostly fine. You're kind of, kind of unsatisfied. You're not particularly soothed. That's okay. How much food? Two chickens, two carrots. Have some more chicken. Have some more pie. It doesn't matter. Boil the fry.
I'm just putting so much fucking fruit in here. It represents the demographics they got going for this game. Okay, let me let me get these plorts in there again, and then maybe I'll finally head out. And do the do the thing and find some slimes to combine the rocks with. Why are y'all so agitated? You just want to be fed fa Fine, you get fed faster. So much faster. So much faster, it's insane. It's unfair how fast you're being fed. Everyone else is looking at it like, no fair. Oh man, that feels good. Wow, okay. The satisfying gameplay loop. I mean, that picture of Barnacle Boy where it just says the, and then, but instead overlaid, it says satisfying gameplay loop. They call me, they call me Penny Big Bucks Parker. We've, we've, we've fucking passed the threshold of efficiency. Okay, after, after these, I'm going. I'm gonna find a new plort to, to feed. You know what I wanna do? I wanna make one of my, I got, um, so I was, I've been looking for, um, new like coffee to like try and have more frequently you know on hand uh that maybe isn't so high in sugar like you know like java monster is um because java monsters for a while were like my go-to like canned just like on hand like cold brew um so i was like trying to find other options and I found this new one, and I'm not gonna say the brand name just yet. Cause... Uh... Cause they haven't sponsored me just yet. <laughs> but... But who knows what could happen in the future, so I'm not... I'm not ripping that band-aid off just yet. Uh... So... But I, but I found a new one. And I like it so far, and it's like powder based. Um, it's like you you make it by like shaking. You like put it in a shaker cup, and it's like cold water and powder that like is is it's like it's like dehydrated cold brew. It's cool. Um, and I've been trying it, and it's pretty good. And I'm about to try a bunch of new flavors just to see if I like the overall. Lineup. Um, because if I do, then, you know, I'll be more comfortable, like, chilling them, like I tend to do with things that I enjoy. And it just sounds like instant coffee. I mean, it is. It's like, but it's but it's like specifically, um, like flavor. It's like specifically like, oh, it's like cold brew, and it's like a bunch of different like flavors and stuff. It's not just like, oh, like olgers, <laughs> you know. Okay, uh, I'm distracted. Okay, so we got the rocks. We already have rocks. Ooh, that guy's pissed off. Let's get out of here. Okay, so I'm definitely not combining rocks and... Oh, shit, you know what I could do? You know what I totally could do? Oh, it would actually maybe fuck up the net. 
but I'm like, I could maybe combine a phosphorus. Gah, honey slime! That's it! Fruit. Fruit. We are the fruit. Oh my god, yo. <laughs> Eureka! Quite literally, the Eureka moment. Eat up! Give me those quartz. They're so pretty. I thought these, I straight up for a moment was like, are these like golden slimes? No, they're honey, but that's honestly even better in a way. I'm completely lost though, I will say. Oh, but we can change that. Hold on. It's, well, hold on, maybe. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Never mind. I'm just going. I'm just gonna go. I have what I I have what I need. Waste of daylight. I gotta get out of here. Which way am I going? Oh fuck, I have no idea. Oh, yes I do. This way. Yeah, it's escape time. Bum, 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 bum. Anyway, did I ever reach a conclusion with my weird coffee stuff? I think I was just gonna say I wanna make some, so I might like get up in a moment. Once I once I I think next time I, like, go to bed. <laughs> I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna get up and, like, in-game, I mean. I'm gonna get up and and make some before I sit back down and for the next, for the next stretch. I don't know how long I'm gonna be streaming tonight. I was not expecting to stream this late. Oh my god, it's... Well, first of all, it's 4.20 in the morning. Thank you so much, god. Um, uh, and also, thank you, uh, Hudson, for the sub. Uh, secondly, oh my god, it's past 4 a.m. And I don't really feel- I kind of- I kind of feel it, but not- not as much as I thought I would. Um. I had, like, a little spell where I was like, oh, I'm definitely tired, I could probably sleep, and then... Then I- I tried to lie down, and then it was just like, well... Not anymore. I was like, what the fuck? Why not? Just like, I don't know. This is a death symbol. Oh. I can't imagine why. <laughs> They're so mad. Woo! Honey and coffee is good. Yeah, honey, 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 coffee is good. Honey and most things is good. Honey and tea slaps. Tea and honey is like. If you want to experience the best of what this world has to offer. Go for that shit. Okay, everyone's dissatisfied, but that's okay. Mommy's got a new experiment. Wham, 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 wham. Become! Become! Yes! Yes! Fuck yeah! In Night City, you can become. Y'all were y'all were veggies, right? Yeah. They can eat fruits and veggies. They have the perfectly balanced diet. Okay, I'm gonna let I'm gonna let I'm gonna let those plorts just like mingle in there for a second. Um. Oh, let's just put the other honey slimes in here too. Yeah, perfect. Um. Let's see what else I got going on in terms of upkeep. Yeah, they have plenty of food for the rest of their life. I wonder if they still stack. Oh yeah, I mean, less efficiently. But I mean, yeah, you can see they're I mean they're they're doing their darnest to get the hell out of here. They wanna be fed so quickly. They're so impatient. What are you hungry or something? 
Are you all... Okay, we still got a couple stragglers out here. That's okay, because we have exactly two plorts left. Yeah! Sick. Gives me slight Wobble Dogs vibes. I mean, in the fact that it's like a, a sim slash, like... Space development, but I mean the like the actual gameplay loop is extremely uh, Extremely unique to, to, to each other uh, These chickens are getting out Twice as fast Twice as fast eggs Oh, storage for old chickens. That's great because that's been a problem for me. That's what is this for? Is this the old chicken keeper? Am I my chicken's keeper? That's a Bible reference for you all. Um, this, but yeah, but like... It's, it's definitely, like, chill, like, kind of wrangling and high personality, cute art style vibes as Wobble Dogs, but this is much more my speed, just in terms of, like, the actual gameplay loop and, like, the way you interact with everything, and, uh, it's just, it's, it's a lot more, uh, it's, it's more agreeable to me, personally. Well, I say that like I don't like Wobble Dogs. I do like Wobble Dogs. Uh, but in terms of streaming, for sure. It's, uh, oh my god, there's so... Everything is so much prettier at night than it is in Slime Rancher 1. They fucking nailed the nighttime art style for this sequel. I don't know how they did it, but they did. Pan. Pan work plums. So now I gotta figure... I think... I think the next step in terms of my high efficiency profit development is gonna be to replace these pink bunny slimes with something that is also a phosphor slime. We need to mix together a phosphor slime and something else. at this point, I just don't think we need pink plorts anymore. There's plenty of pink slimes all over the place. All the time. Oh. Okay, is the time going? I don't think so. Okay, really quickly. I wonder if I could just, like... No, it would, it would, it would definitely not fit in the water bottle. I have to... I have to... Maybe wash my shaker cup really. I'm 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 trying to determine whether there's something I need I need to go to BRB screen for. Um, yeah, yeah. I I I need to. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the BRB screen. I'm just gonna make myself a little coffee. Um, it should only take like, literally like, a couple minutes. Um, and then I'll be back with more gameplay. Here we.
I am back. Also, uh, sorry, did, did I accidentally mute the, the BRB screen as well as the game? Because that's exactly what I was not trying to do. Oh no, I'm sorry. For any newcomers, that's not normally what the BRB screen is like. Okay, I got my, uh, I got my shaking up coffee. I'm gonna let it sit for a second. Um, let's fucking get back to it. I'm so... Okay, what was even... Hold on, let me try and regain my... Next, next big step for slime corralling phosphor, phosphor slime instead of pink bunnies. But I need to find something else to combine the phosphor slimes with, I guess. I don't know why, don't ask me why. I just feel like it's a necessity. Yeah, sorry. So, so the way that the 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 reason that happened is because the way I have my um audio system set up, I totally forgot that like. So like when when I'm streaming something from console, I never have to worry about it, because my console audio comes through a completely different channel than like my PC like desktop audio. But in a case like this. The PC game is coming through the same channel as the... Oh, that's the wrong... Whoops. PC channel is coming through the same... Or the PC game audio is coming through the same channel as everything that I'm monitoring through OBS. So, like... Usually... Um, or, so, so like, the, 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 the BRB screen music... You hear it through stream because it 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 plays through my system audio and and then OBS like picks it up in return and sends it through as as music on the stream onto the audio track. Um, but in this case, it was like I I I just muted system audio because I didn't I didn't think that that would um fuck up the BRB screen, but alas, it did anyway. I, I completely did not explain that well. <laughs> that was like very uh not straightforward. That's okay though. So many old ones. You can be meat. Oh, is there a hunter stack? I missed it visually. I did see. I was not looking. Alright, I gotta... I gotta take a sip of this. Or it's, or while it's still somewhat cold, at least. I do like it. do like it. Jury's still out on the rest of the flavors I just got, but man, I could I could keep that in rotation for sure. Honey plorts are broken. 61 on a bad day. We're good to go, I think. Let's get some uh Let's get some ah! I dropped my Switch Pro controller. Um I got this little controller holder for the bottom of my desk um it like attaches to the to the bottom and it like holds controllers like suspended underneath my desk table and it's really cool and it's been really useful because it helps me clear up desk space um problem is that i'm not used to it being there so th i'm not used to it being there yet so the way i move sometimes <laughs> I will just fucking bump into it and knock my controllers over because they're not super secure, admittedly. They're just kind of laying there. Um, I maybe should find like an alternative version of this idea that uh, has more security for the controllers it's holding. Oh, there's more dialogue. Also, Ghostly Howler, hi. Welcome in. Always, always nice to see newcomers in. Dora West. 
Well, now, if it isn't Beatrix LeBeau. Oh, Hobby and I were just talking about you. Word is you went off to parts unknown off of this here rock with a thirst for new adventure. And a girl. You just keep on walking to see what new wonders are around the next corner until your boots have holes. And then get yourself some new boots and do it some more. <laughs> Me, well, my boots have seen better days, but... I know there's still an adventurer or two left in them. I suppose I just need to figure out what. Oh heck, I'm rambling just like Hobson does after he gets to talking about exploring, the cosmos, cooking, or uh, pretty much any other topic. All right, B, you hang in there. I'll be calling to check in on you. Doesn't matter who you are, we all start feeling it when home is beyond the horizon. Oh, before I forget, Here's a little something for you to spruce up your new place. It ain't much, but you need to do what you can to make that place feel cozy. Aiming pal. Oh. Also, can I call them again? It's in the middle of something. Yeah, okay. They just don't have favors for me right now. In fact, they are just giving me things that I can make. So, speaking of. So, what does that do? That's the wrong one. Ang calm the anger of any feral slime that hears it. That's pretty good. Pretty damn good. Not going to lie. Why do I have this roost in my backpack? Have you ever just had a stray chicken in your bag? And I don't mean a nugget. <laughs> Come on now. Okay, uh, so I can't... Holy fuck. An unknower, thank you so much for the ten gifted subs. I believe you also gifted subs earlier, so thank you for the continued patronage. Uh, and now the alerts are just going to run through because I do not have it set up to uh, alert gifted subs separately. Um, but I will, I'll fix that up soon, at some point. What am I gonna combine with, uh, Foster Slimes? What did I, what did I say I was gonna do? I could do Phosphor and Bunny, maybe. But again, we have so much Bunny representation. What, what, do we, have we found anything that's not covered yet? Lucky Slimes, Larjos, Feral, Latar, Gordo, yeah, all right. Uh, maybe do some exploring today. Honestly, yeah, here's here's what I'll do. I'll do some exploring right away. Find something. Ooh. Are you? Fuck. Well, that was a missed opportunity. Oh, oh, okay. What would what would foster slimes go good? Something new. We need something new. <sighs> Honestly, I feel like we're maybe not gonna find anything super new until we like uh upgrade our situation more. Upgrade the backpack, very least. I don't know, though. Oh! You're cool. You could, you could, you could be something. You could be something for us. Let's just, let's just start stuffing this guy and see, see what we get out of it. Any sweets? Any treats? Any little things to eat? Oh, get out of here. Still growing. I wonder if we can, like, it'd be so useful if we could place, like, pins. 
Oh shit, it it ends it for us, I think. Wait, but then didn't we didn't we run into another uh Gordo at some point that was like underground? What happened to it? It should be marked, I imagine. Oh well, well. We can just use that pin for now. Ah! Stony hands. We'll do the trick. Until I find a better pick. God, this is... Yeah, this is about the point of the game where I could use some... Some of that teleporting action. They were selling to me earlier. No! No! Oh, too many! Way too many! Oh, the music is very, uh... Breath of the Wild Guardian theme core. It's ready to just give you a heart attack. The earliest convenience. Get out of here. No thanks. Oh! Look at that. Sick. Yes! Uh, the reach! Uh, ah, she has the range, but she fell down. Oh, but that's okay. It's all coming together. It's all coming together. Oh, get out of here. For later. Jelly stone, like from Winnie the Pooh. Dude, I'm so far away. Oh, fuck. I gotta start looking out for these more. How did I get so far away? Dude, you would not believe the trek I had to go through to feed your sorry ass. You're still not exploded? Where'd you get your stamina? Goodbye. <laughs> he will have his own adventure. Every cat's got to leave the nest at some point. Don't get mad at me, it's just nature. There we go. Nice. Go and then. What the fuck? I was gonna say that's it. That was just a bunch of cheap walk cycles. But no, we're good. We have elevation. Oh, grab that. Yes. Sir. Elevation, teleportation, recreation. Uh oh. What does the chef have that's new? He is asking what is new! Well, what did you say? I told him I would ask! What is going on? A customer is asking what is new. Well, what did you tell them? I told them I would ask! It's a ratatouille, if you've never seen that masterpiece. Ah! New! 
Get over here! Angler slime. More like anger slime. I think it- wait, I said that already, actually. Benny Parker is asking what is new! Well, what did you tell her? I told her I would ask! I told her I would develop a sequel. That's not the right way. Uh oh. Oh god, I need to go. I understand there was a missed opportunity for fortune, but the thing about fortune is that we have it. You know, you just gotta look in front of you. I'm scared that I'm gonna get home, and it's just gonna be a fucking disaster. Oh, shit. Here. I need to have phosphorus limes on hand, I just realized. Very cool. Okay. Uh... I can always get more jellystone. I will have an angler plort on hand as well. And more carrots. I don't need carrots. Yo, you know what? Okay, yeah. That, that'll... S Tabby. Um. Okay, we need to go. We need to go. I have there's so much I need to upkeep back at the ranch. I imagine shit is going awry right now, or shit is about to go awry soon if it's not already gone awry. My slimes are probably so agitated. I don't know if I properly... I didn't think I would be out this long. But I guess I was planning to be out until night anyway, so... Whose fault is it, really? That's okay. We'll see. We'll see. The issue now, though, is that I gotta spend time... Uh... Ooh, yeah, they're angry. Okay, okay, uh... Ooh, okay. Let me sate the ones that... ...are... ...getting real... Yeah, y'all are real upset. Y'all are kind of the most dangerous right now. Uh, you could use some food. Y'all are good to go. Y'all are good to go. The pink slimes are probably not super good to go, but that's okay, because, uh, they will be going. This is gonna take a second, <laughs> but the necessary part of the cycle. This is the most horrific thing <laughs> I've ever done. I'm sorry, little one. Sevens in chat, killing me. Listen, at the end of the day, God gives his his toughest missions to his bravest soldiers. You get to fly. I don't know- I don't know why- I don't know why this stream has been so religious. I guess I did earlier say that this was gonna be the most Christian Slime Rancher stream. I didn't know I would actually follow through with that promise, though. I wasn't intending to. Just kinda how it worked out. 
That's a disgusting pogo fruit. Who let that happen? Solar shield. Sick. Yes, create! Oh, they're so interesting. Okay, now it's time to sleep. such a fucking, uh, just a beautiful circle of life going on in that little, little hen corral. I feel like we can add more, even. The abundance of jinkin. There's still just, like, so many more. Oh my god, man. Y'all will not be wanting for, for for dietary needs for long at this rate. Things are like good to go. Here. Putting that back up to to mid. That's how I feel about y'all motherfuckers. Diet, fruit, meat, and fruit. Okay. We need to create more hybrids. So... Anglers are meat. Okay, so far so good. That should be enough for them to. Yeah, <laughs> we are creating a situation. Yes, uh, cool. Keep at it. Keep at it. You got it. There we go. There we go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. And then uh, we're gonna also give y'all. Music box, soothe your agitation, and an auto feeder, finally. Okay, go ahead and get rid of these. We will no longer be needing pink quartz. No normies in here. We'll clean all the other ones up later. Oh, shit! Oh, Arbaku, you had such a good fucking idea. And I completely... I just didn't even think about it. I didn't even think. The pink ports totally should have gone in the refiner. You're <laughs> absolutely right. I'll do that now. I've, I'm literally, I'm, li I'm thinking, I'm thinking profit. <laughs> I'm thinking long-term profit margins. Innovation? Who needs her? I don't even know her. Okay. Get, uh, nutrient soil. Sprinkler. Also have nutrient soil. Yes. Perfect. You also need nutrient soil. Couldn't have worked out better. Couldn't have worked out better. They like stun each other when they uh create plorts, I'm noticing. That's interesting. Wahoo! Okay. 
Okay. So, these first angler plorts, I'm actually going to put in the refinery. Because I want to start thinking innovation now. Because now we, you know, we have them all wrangled. We have a, a, a perfectly plentiful supply of fruit, which is what they eat. So we know there will always be more plorts from them. Plort. Plort uh, supply will not be wanting anytime soon with those guys. Yeah, they, yeah, they got plorts out the wazoo. Oh, speaking of... Honestly, honest to God, uh, all 20 of these can go in the refinery right away. Honestly, never seen any Slime Rancher content until the other day when this one came out in Early Access. Now I really want both games myself. Well, I hope you can get your hands on a copy of either. Um, it's definitely a very, very relaxing time. floor economy is booming. Yeah. Especially with, with poor man toes, like, port, port economy going on. Like, come on. Come on to me. Wait, that sounded like I just said come on to me, which is not appropriate. <laughs> I didn't. Just to... Just to clarify. sell these. Oh man, we have so many. In a single night, we've officially passed the threshold where I now wish there was automation for collecting and selling the plorts. Just keep, just keep that steady cash flow coming. You know? Have any olds for me? No? Okay. Well, they had one. One is basically none. That's how that works. Oh, they need more food. What was I feeding y'all? I was feeding them. Y'all get carrots. Y'all get hens. Perhaps you can be fed olds. That's Q berries. You can only have one type of fruit in there at a time. I should to I should make sure this is always pogo fruit because like the pogo fruit thing is right next to it. There, this is like it's it's just not efficient. Am I awake? Uh, I'm playing Slime Rancher. Yeah, it seemed, it seemed pretty self explanatory, all things considered. <laughs> Ends. Oh, 
Y'all are fucking happy. That's awesome. That's awesome for you. Okay. I am not hurting for money at the moment. So instead, every port goes to the refinery, baby. Uh, let's fucking go. This is just gonna be my my day today. Like <laughs> if this 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 loop right here of just more plorts, more plorts, more plorts. Back and forth. I got a beach. Well now I kinda wish I kept some pink slimes around. You know what? You know what'll fix that? Jumping into the whole ocean, apparently. No, uh... Let's maybe expand. I think it might be time to do some expansion. Here, or here, or go here. It's more... This one's smaller, so it's maybe a little... A little less overwhelming. Oh, wait, that- I think that's a cave. Is this the cave one? Oh. Oh, not really. There's not, like, a designated cave one. Okay. What is this? The den. Oh. Oh, shit. This would have been a great place to put the phosphor slime. So, wait, hold on. Actually... This one back here might actually be a great first expand. Oh, fields of rainbow grass. Don't mind if I do. Please. I have to see. Oh, is this just... Rainbow grass? Just it's just the grass. That's fine. I still appreciate what you've done here. Now I'm like a place like this needs a more uh, special slime population. Um, but actually. Let's go, let's go collect some pink slimes. Actually, let's go to bed first. This is officially for Pogo Fruit. Oh god, the girls are fighting. You have plenty of hens, calm down. Y'all are mostly fine, but you need carrots. Oh, and there's plenty. Can you choose from? I'm gonna slow down your feeding. You go back to middle. Uh... Yikes, okay. Y'all need olds. Please tell me there are more olds in store. None of you are getting old? What's your deal? Okay, fine. You don't want to get old? Then stay mid. That'll be your problem. Roostros are now on the menu. Okay, before we... Okay, I'm actually... And also, I'm gonna slow down the feeding rate. Because there's only three of you in there. So, really do not have to worry too much about that.
Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. I keep thinking I'm seeing like a bug in my peripheral vision, but I don't know. It's like maybe just like a weird like floater or whatever. Every time I look, it's nothing. I feel like I'm going insane. Yo, you know what? Before I go out and collect pink slimes... Do I have enough to upgrade, uh... Oh, I need sand. Wait, no, that's... No, that's not true. I need... Aha! I have enough? Of everything. Wow. Literally exactly enough heavy ports. Unless it was just counting that I had enough and stopped counting of the needed amount. That's okay. Now I can hold 30 of things. Which is great. It's pink time. No need those. Unnecessary. I'm going minimalist. Only the only the only the necessities right now. They pink and normal. Stay normal, stay normal. I get some jelly stone. Just while I'm here. No! Would this game be technically a shooter? No. <laughs> I know that's probably mostly a joke, but I can't resist answering genuinely. Uh, no, it's- it's just- it's just a... First person, uh, first person sim is, is, would, it would be its, its genre. Some, some maybe say life sim. I actually, I don't think life sim applies. I think it's first person, like, uh, first person farm sim is probably the closest. Um, because this is not a gun, it's a vacuum. There's a difference. Forgot to shake the egg beaters before pouring them. Well, you better start running. Annoying that they just stopped inventing old people, apparently. When when I got the thing that collected old people.
Like, yeah, of course that would happen. That's real efficient. Thanks. Real convenient for me. Put these jelly stones in the finery. Okay, now what? Oh, we got some dialogue to read. Hold on. Me. Time to receive payment for my hard work. Water kills the slime. Water, um... Water kills, uh, tarred slimes, at the very least. I don't know, I don't think in normal slimes, unless they change that or unless I forgot. Do I have any of these in the refinery? Can I check? And why can't I check it from here? <laughs> We got some. I guess I just put all of them in there, though. I actually was not thinking when I did that. I actually didn't come down here intending to put all of the plorts in there. I just wanted to see if I had any. And if I didn't, I would put some. But I was actually planning on selling the rest. But then I just... My brain just died for a second. I ended up selling all of them. So, you know, normal. Uh... Definitely jet. What the fuck? Radiant ore is not around at the moment. I don't know where to get that, so... This this whole new material system is... It's throwing off my groove. Also, 5 a.m. so no worries. Yeah, <laughs> I'm feeling... I can definitely feel myself winding down, for sure. No! Wrong! Chickens go back in. That's where you belong. Get it twisted. God, it's just like it's it just never ends. There's all there's always something else to do now. I'm officially past any point of there being a possible lull in the gameplay loop. Like, it's, there's always just something. It's like, oh, there's new plorts. Or, oh, shit. Oh, there's new... Oh, they need more food. Uh... Always something. Which I, I, I'm not complaining about. It's... It's juicy. Let me, let me see if I can do some more inventing. 
what, what have I got going on? Okay. Utilities. Amy Bell, no way. Yellow home portal. I need more jellystone and some deep brine. I don't know where the fuck that would be. I can't really do anything because I'm not finding these, like, materials easily. Oh, you know what? Let me read this, uh... uh keep forgetting I have a notification thing. Hey! Uh, Bob, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember. I remember this guy. Hello, Beatrix. I wanted to tell you that I've cracked another one of the AI ciphers. It had clearly adapted to my previous solve and created something even more complex. Clever. This time, the code revealed a set of instructions for back and forth communication, so I've been spending my time talking to it. It asks a lot of questions. After getting to know me, it's been asking me a lot about my work. Almost like it's feeling out the areas of my expertise. I must admit, it has all been rather flattering. I'm used to being the one asking the questions. For a while, my whole life was questions and the research that followed. But having experienced that for so long, it feels as though I can sense the same in others. And though this may say, this may seem strange, uh, that's a typo. I sense this in the AI. You see, when I began asking questions of my own, the way it responded to me, I felt like it was trying to guard itself, to hide a profound loneliness that it has within its heart. Strange, I know. It is an AI after all, but who's to say that any form of intelligence wouldn't desire a connection to another? I feel there's more to this story, and if not, I'm happy to have simply been there for my new friend to continue asking questions so that they have a reason to find answers. I'll report back later. Beatrix, I'm glad you called. I looked over the pics you sent me of Rainbow Island, uh, no doubt they are a sight to behold. Beautiful, with colors that only go richer the longer you look. But unnatural, too. I'm sorry, but something about that place is not right. You may recall, I was once the head of a very successful Insta-Food Corporation. Genetically altering food was our specialty. I am not proud of the lengths we went to alter natural food to grow bigger, faster, and cheaper. To strip it of the good stuff in favor of profits. I say this, Beatrix, because I can still spot a plant that has been unnaturally altered when I see it. And the beautiful rainbows you see before you on that island did not arrive there naturally. It's not clear to me if this spells any sort of danger for you, but it gives me an uneasy feeling in my stomach. Need to do more research and get back to you. Stay safe, amiga. Oh, shit. Well, <laughs> well, we know he's maybe not Russian. Hello, fellow Herman. Pass this for... <laughs> Chickens? <laughs> cool. <laughs> Thanks, Bob. That guy seemed very personable. Are there any new slimes? The chat member is asking what is new! Well, what did you tell them? I told them I would ask! Also, yes. <laughs> to answer your question for real. There's plenty. Oh, 
Oh shit. I need to check on the pink slimes. I need to check on the normies. Oh, normies. No stragglers. <laughs> Or means hello. Hi there. Oh, y'all are doing great. Only six? Come on. What? This is going right in the refinery, and then I am going to sleep until morning. <laughs> Normal way to walk upstairs. <laughs> I've discovered it. Discovered the most normal way. Send the stairs. Okay. Um, well, shit. I think, like, what can I do right now? Honestly, I wanted to, like, get more done tangibly. I feel like I'm still, like, I'm still, still awaiting another, like, threshold of progress where, like, suddenly my space becomes, like, a lot more, like, science-based and maybe a little more automated. Um, but truthfully, I'm I'm losing it. <laughs> like I'm, I'm I'm slowly fading. So um, I might I might call it quits in just a minute. It is uh it is nearly 5:30 for me. So seems appropriate generally. A lot of the automation isn't in yet, unfortunately. Damn. They really are, like, just... Doing the same thing as Slime Rancher 1, huh? Like, even the... The... Early access progression. You would think... Slime Rancher 2 would start off with... Possibly a similar amount of content as, like, final Slime Rancher 1. But, I guess these games are more, kind of... Active by design the, the the way the release like builds on itself over time seems to be just the way that they do these games which is it's it's interesting what's the end goal here um i would like to create an impressive enough uh, slime ranch that my dad will finally love me. I feel like we're about maybe a fourth of the way there. I think I've I think I've hit a wall of just like I I want to do like something more like actively interesting progression wise, but in order to do that, I have to invest time like going out and trying to like scour for like materials and shit, and I just don't I don't have it in me right now. Uh, so I think I'm gonna call it here. What a cozy little stream! Didn't even didn't even reach four hours, but honestly, um, man, this you know what? It's more slime rancher. Um, honestly, like, it's fucking beautiful. And obviously the base, like, Slime Rancher gameplay loop is addictive as hell, and I love it. And so I had a great time playing this, but also, um, I will say I'm, I'm kind of surprised at how kind of the same it is. 
as the experience of the first game. Honestly, the thing that changed the most is like the visual aspect of this game. Like they rebalanced certain things. Um, they introduced more flirt spending for like character upgrades, but like, I'm curious to see how this develops. I'm curious to see how this develops over um, over time compared to the first. Because um, definitely right now it's like, yeah, it's, I mean, it's the, it's kind of the same. Yeah, I, th I think most of the differences come in, of course, like the visual aspect, which is just, I can't stress enough, this game is absolutely gorgeous. It is a, just a visual treat. Um, everything looks beautiful. Uh, it's right up my alley, visually. Um, but like, also, yeah, there's like some new, um, exploration. There's, there's a new way that exploration kind of works, which is cool. Um, I like that the, I like that the Gordos don't just like explode and give you like a bunch of like resources. Like they actually unlock like new areas. Um, I think that's super cool. Like that's a re that's a I think that's a much better way to do it. It's a, it's a little bit more engaging. Um, it doesn't it, it like it feeds into a different gameplay loop or a different part of the gameplay loop than um, than just your basic resource management. Because at a certain point, if you if you you know if you know what you're doing, you get to the point where you don't fucking need the Gordos to give you like fruit. <laughs> you know, like you can get a really efficiently running garden up extremely quick. I mean, we just saw it happen. You know, my my carrots and, and, and berries and shit were like, they were popping off after like no time at all. I'm not even four hours into the game and I have like more fruit than I could ever eat. Um, so that's pretty cool. I like, I like how they re, I like how they restructured exploration. And I think if, if more of the new stuff in the game kind of revolves around that, I think that's an interesting way to do it because, um, I can see that being a cool way to expand on some new stuff while keeping the core, like actual, like, like ranch sim gameplay basically the same as the first one because like if it ain't broke don't fix it right like you know just rebalance it make it a little bit more like what you're looking for in terms of like progression pacing for new players and then maybe like put your resources in terms of new stuff into the world and exploration environment so i think i can yeah i think i can see what they're doing here in terms of that but um it wasn't ex like I I think I I don't know why I was expecting maybe more of like a shake up of the actual like ranching mechanics, um. Like, the like everything with the conservatory and like the the slime corrals and stuff is nearly exactly the same. Which is I I guess I just wasn't expecting that, but um I'm not against it because it's a winning formula for sure. It's fun as hell so. Yeah, um, I'm gonna go. I'm just, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna, gonna go sleep. All right. Uh, please take care. Um, I'll see y'all soon. Maybe, um, maybe Monday for The Last of Us. Maybe, if not Monday, then Tuesday. Uh, I'm gonna be streaming Fairly Odd Parent Shadow Showdown this Tuesday. I'm excited for that. Uh, because that's the good Fairly Odd Parents game. So, we'll finally have that to juxtapose my nightmare experience with breaking the rules. Um, and of course, more God of War on Wednesday and all that. So, keep an eye out. Got some more fun stuff happening real soon. But, um, until then, uh, just be good to yourselves and, uh, rest up. Take care. 